Hi guys, it's Eveline from Lisa's Law. Today we will focus on the laws you need to know about renting in the UK, particularly in relation to landlord's eviction. We will continue the theme of previous episode and discuss how long it takes for a landlord who meets all the conditions and decides to use Section 21 to evict a tenant. For example, how much notice is required and what if the tenant insists on not leaving? First of all, the length of the notice depends on the nature of the breach of the terms of the contract. Generally, the notice period is at least two months. But if you have a fixed term renter contract, the notice period must be the same as the contract period. If the tenant refuses to leave, the landlord can apply to court for a compulsory possession order. In deciding whether to grant mandatory grounds possession, the court will take into account different circumstances. For example, if the landlord needs to take possession of the house it was once used as a primary residence or now plans to use as a primary residence, then this reason is usually accepted. There are other reasons these include if the property is subject to a mortgage or the contract is not more than eight months and was previously on a holiday let. Keep in mind, however, the court will also consider circumstances as its discretion, such as the tenant being in rent areas or destruction of the property, which may be grounds for granting possession. If you find this content helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel for more updates on the law and other useful information. Until next time.